Hello dear all welcome to Sandha Education Academy I am Santosh Wag in this video we will see exercise 4.2 of chapter 4 practical geometry class 8 mathematics here we will see how to construct quadrilateral with the given data so let's start our video exercise 4.2 question number 1 construct the following quadrilateral l i f t and these dimensions are given here now see this quadrilateral l i f t where this dimensions are given means here dimensions of three sides are given and dimensions of two diagonals are given with the help of this we will draw a quadrilateral l i f t so just draw a rough sketch of this quadrilateral l i f t for our better understanding put this vertex is l i f t l i is given 4 cm then i f i f given 3 cm t l what is it? this is t l t l is given 2.5 cm l f this is a l f l f is a diagonal this diagonal is given 4.5 cm then it this is it it is also a diagonal and that 4 cm is given all dimensions are in cm now to start we will start with if so take if this and this 3 cm is given so put this 3 cm dimension rf so this point i and this f we got these two points to get next point that is l point where 4.5 cm away from f and 4 cm away from i so we will make we will make arc of 4 cm and 4.5 cm to get point l so first make an arc of 4 cm take this 4 cm arc from point i make an arc then make an arc of 4.5 cm make an arc of 4.5 cm from point f the intersecting point will be l this intersecting point will be l draw this line i l join these two points and also this diagonal because these diagonal dimensions are given now we will locate point t which is 2.5 cm away from point l and 4 cm away from r so again we will make two arcs two arc means arc of 2.5 cm and arc of 4 point arc of 4 cm this arc of 4 cm 4 cm that is away from point i this i point make an arc of 4 cm and make an arc of 2.5 cm make an arc of 2.5 cm this is 2.5 cm make an arc of 2.5 cm from point l the intersecting point make an arc of 2.5 cm then intersecting point is point t this is point t join this points tf this is a tf and again join this lt so thus we got quadrilateral l i f t this is quadrilateral dimensions are 
this 4 cm this 3 cm this 2.5 cm this diagonal 4.5 cm and this this diagonal is 4 cm and this diagonal is 4.5 cm now see question number second of exercise 4.2 construct the following quadrilateral g o l d here dimensions of three sides and dimension of two diagonals are given we will draw a rough sketch of g o l d this quadrilateral suppose this is a rough sketch of g o l d g o l d where o l this o l dimension is given 7.5 cm then g l this g l this is a diagonal this diagonal is given 6 cm then g d this length is given 6 cm again l d this l d is 5 cm and o d this diagonal is o d is 10 cm means dimensions of three sides and dimensions of two diagonals are given with the help of this we will draw quadrilateral g o l d now let's start with this o l o l is given 7.5 cm so we will draw o l as 7.5 cm from this point this is a 7 and this is 7.5 cm this is a o l o l now to locate point d this dimension dl is given 5 cm and o d this o d is given 10 cm we will make two arcs two arcs of dimensions 5 cm and dimensions 10 cm and we will draw these two arcs to get point d so first we will arc first we will make arc of 10 cm this 10 cm arc will be from point o so this is point o and we will make arc of this is arc of 10 cm and arc of 5 cm is also we require so draw this 5 cm arc from point L is from point L so intersecting point will be D this is the intersecting point this is the point D so join these two points L D and D D O is diagonal so we will this draw this diagonal also <coughs> Now to locate point G, we know this is away from D by 6 cm and away from L by 6 cm. So we will make two arcs of 6 cm and intersecting point of these two arcs if we will draw it from point D and from point L will be point G. So this dimension 6 cm so make an arc of 6 cm from this point L and also from point D so this is the intersecting point and this intersecting point is G join this point G O G O and G D this gld and this diagonal and this diagonal gl this diagonal gl thus we have constructed quadrilateral gold whose dimensions are gd is 6 cm then gl is also 6 cm 
then OD this diagonal is of 10 cm this OL is 7.5 cm and LD is 5 cm thus this is a quadrilateral GOLD whose dimensions are this now see question number 3 of exercise 4.2 construct the following quadrilateral rhombus B E N D rhombus is given B E N D and here two dimensions are given we know for constructing any quadrilateral we require minimum five dimensions but for special quadrilateral here for rhombus we need only two dimensions because rhombus is a special quadrilateral whose opposite sides are parallel and also equal and one more property is diagonals of rhombus are bisecting each other and are also perpendicular to each other so by using these properties we will construct rhombus b e n d so uh, just draw a rough sketch of rhombus is rhombus means all sides are equal and opposite sides are parallel let's see these dime these vertices are b b e n and this is d dimension b n this b n is given 5.6 centimeter and this d e this dimension is given 6.5 centimeter means diagonals are given and we have to draw this rhombus we know for rhombus diagonals are perpendicular to each other means this angle is 90 degree and also they bisect each other means if this is intersecting point then BO is equal to ON and DO is equal to OE so these are bisecting each other and by using this pro property we will construct rhombus first we will draw this BE that is a 6.5 cm and this is a 5.6 cm BN how this will be let draw this DE that is 6.5 cm this is 6 and 6.5 this is a 6.5 cm this dimension is 6.5 these points are D and this point is E now we know this is perpendicular these two diagonals are perpendicular to each other so we will first make a center point of this in this center point of this how to make center point of this just take this 6.5 this so center point will be 3.25 so this is a 3 this is 3.2 this is 3.25 this is center point and from this center point we will make a perpendicular line how we can draw a perpendicular line take this protractor and match this center point with the center point of protractor mark he mark this 90 degree and just draw a line just draw a rough line just draw a rough line which is perpendicular to this now this diagonal dimensions are given this diagonal dimension is bn is 5.6 and this is also bisecting point this is bisecting point so make half dimension here and half dimension on this side draw this draw this line just in and mark 5.6 half of 5.6 is half of 5.6 divided by 2 it is it will be 2.8 so 
make here 2.8 and 2.8 here 1 2 and this is 2.8 here also 10 20 and this is 2.8 here so we got two points and these two points are this is a point b this is point n join this b and d we will get this line bd and also join this b e we will get this line join this point e n e n and join this n d join this n d thus we got a rhombus b e n d where this diagonal b n b n is 5.6 centimeter and this d e this d e is 6.5 centimeter we have drawn this rhombus by using property of rhombus that diagonals of rhombus are perpendicular to each other this angle is 90 degree and these diagonals bisect each other so these are the bisecting each other means ob and on are equal and also do and oe are equal this is all for this video we will meet again in our next video do learn do enjoy Thank you.